hey y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl layla here so we're about to be doing a photo shoot this is yesterday's footage of me ripping off this canvas and using the frame as part of the photo shoot okay i am gonna explain the photo shoot in a bit but here i am just ripping it up and i'm gonna paint over it give it that extra brown look and i've got my focus face on because i'm really about to get this done <laughs> So yeah, here it is. Look at that. It looks so good, don't it? Yeah, exactly. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm not done with it, but and here it is so far. I got the frame. It looks real vintage and old school right now. But y'all see when it comes together. So that was yesterday's um, thing that I had to do. I um, was working on the background, like the props part. And it did not take that long. The paint really just melted in that, in that little frame. So I'm like, okay. This is gonna be easy. I'm taking my hair loose now. Let me show you what I have in mind for the photo shoot. You guys probably not gonna tell what it looks like, but I'll point it out and I'll show you. So I like photo shoots that have depth and meaning. Obviously when you're looking at this, it's like, girl, this got no meaning to it. What the world? But yeah, <laughs> this is actually gonna be me and this is gonna be um, the frame and then I'm gonna put gray paper in it. And then I have my earrings right here. Oh, I gotta do my earrings too, I forgot to say that. And then I'm gonna be doing something a bit different from the hoodie part that's like crumbled. You'll see, I call this one my feelings on a canvas. It's a two part photo shoot. I like this one and y'all just gonna have to wait and see, okay. So this image right here, I believe Lori Harvey. I like her makeup, the way she has that, whatever that is, over covering her head. And so that type of concept is gonna be led in this photo shoot. That's gonna be the main thing. But instead of that little hoodie thing that she has, I'm gonna use this. I'm not not this for the hoodie, that's don't fit on my head. For that, like I said, her look, the makeup, the look is good. As well as this image. I love this look. I love her, I love her lip look. I love the eyeliner. I love it all. It looks really good. So we're gonna combine those two and um, yeah. I got the makeup back. We keep everything up in here. Yeah. You're gonna you're gonna see the um the outfit at the end after I do my makeup in here, okay? We here with it with our uh, squeaky chair and uh, our hair needs to be put back some before I slick back. Okay, so before I slick back these beautiful curls, I just wanna show you guys the growth. It's been like four months since I cut my hair really short. Now it's let's see, let me check, let me stand up. Stand up. So it's right here. It's almost at my lock. It's really good. I've been taking care of it and really not doing too much. But now I'm like, okay, we're gonna leave it alone. We're gonna leave it alone. And we left it alone. And look at it. Exactly. Exactly. And I'm just putting in a ponytail at the back and I'm going to slick the front part. We're gonna go like, we'll slick just the front pieces. Of we're gonna figure out how to slick it, where we're gonna slick it in the direction. I still wanna do extra edges, okay? Let's get into it. I think I'm gonna just do a montage and y'all just watch like that, okay? I'm low key conflicted. <laughs> should I have it like this? You know, put the little thing, put some of the hair in the back, fluff it out. Or should I put all of it in the back? Like how I originally had in mind. I'm liking this one because it just looks really good. <laughs> the curls, you know, the curls are flowy and all of that. Like they're doing what they need to do today. I think I'm gonna just stick with what I had in mind. Let's just stay on course and then we'll adjust as we need, okay? Y'all see pictures posted of me in this hairstyle? Just mind your business because it's giving. It, it actually it is, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So for the edges, I don't do my edges too often, but we will try. So there's a lot of different types of looks. A lot of um, a lot of black girls like to do for the edges. I have long sideburns, so I have to really go down here. But I um, I like to keep it basic in my definition of that. But we gotta step out of the box, okay? So I didn't even tell about the meaning of this photo shoot. So honestly, it didn't have a meaning at first. But then I was like, well, I wanted to show feelings, and sometimes I like to showcase my feelings in a sense. You know, when it comes to my art, I do art short take pictures and have certain colors that evoke certain emotions and that's what i wanted to show for this photo shoot putting my feelings on a canvas it's going to be a two-part series this one's the first one and then we have a continuation i already have the photo shoot idea ready to go okay love that for me right yeah see i'm already doing it basic i gotta step out of the box okay so i'm thinking we might go ahead and swoop okay what if i swoop it like that i didn't do nothing that was right Oh, did it do it? Oh, it did it. Like that. Uh, maybe this goes more up. And do the rest of these. Like that. Mm. 
Okay, maybe I should swoop it again like this one. Mm, okay, what about that? A little rough, a little rough, but I can solidify it and fill it up. That looks pretty good. Let me just fix this part. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Let's do this side, okay? Yeah. Uh oh, this don't look right. <laughs> oh, when it comes to being extra, I'm like, how do I do that? We're just gonna we're just gonna add a little bit, like go like that, probably on this side because this takes too long. Okay. Y'all, I wasn't able to do it too extra on that side. It was hard. Either way, I'ma just put that on. Now we can do our makeup. And like I said, we're doing these looks. Okay. We're gonna combine them, okay? There's a couple of downside, downsides kind of when it comes to doing my hair before my makeup. You can see right here, my sideburns are kind of longer. They don't really get under here unless I cover this up. But if I cover this up, then the makeup is only gonna get right here. So all oh, this gonna be looking crazy. And that's not, that's not how we doing it right now, okay? I'm just realizing I didn't get any type of like lip thing for, like for glitter. I am not gonna do the lip. I'm just gonna do the eye that way and I'm gonna figure out the lip later on, okay? So I have a palette of colors. Let's do a YouTube hand again. Okay, okay yeah. I'm gonna go with this one right here. This one right here. Right here, yeah. So here we go. We have that. Yeah, yeah, we see the shimmers coming together, right? When it comes to this picture, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just go ahead and add it like that. Just shake the outside, but the inside will be, oh, we're good, we're good. Here's what we have. I have. My eyes are not symmetrical. <laughs> I'm just saying, no, I don't have, they look slightly different if you look at it. And um, I think I'm liking it so far. This is what we have, okay? So I decided to add the little thing like that. I put one line right here, similar to hers, but not too much. I'm gonna add more dots on it. You see, I put one right there. I actually messed up, but I'm gonna improvise. For the lip, we're gonna do a dark lip, like the actual image. And then I think I might add something for like gloss or something to add. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. We're gonna do my nails too. Gotta take these off. These are actually stickers. They have like the nail stickers. Maybe I don't have to take them off. We'll see. Let's go to it now, okay? The way I do know that there are some pieces on my face that isn't blended. So if you're looking at those pieces, so I'm gonna take this uh, loose. Hopefully my curls, I gotta really fix this one because it kind of curled up for the final reveal. We have it. It looks pretty good. I'm liking it. I kind of want to take the hair out. That's not what we have in plans. That's not what we have planned. I just remember I need to put lashes on. So I had the lashes and now I'm trying to figure out what to wear. Here I have, have a blazer on, but I'm thinking about putting my black bobby pins or safety pins that I have and adding it like that, you know what I mean? Give it like that closed look. I couldn't find anything that's gray that matches it, but we're gonna be all right because black and gray, you know, it's a good little duo. And um, I'm gonna go find my safety pins so that I can use them right now. Yeah, I'm gonna just do that and I'm gonna just keep going and I'm gonna just add the rest of them and layer them like that. Just not too much of the focus, so if they don't look right, that's fine. You can always fix it. But um, we're gonna do this for now. We're gonna add the layers of the bobby pins like that. I took the hair out the ponytail with thing I had going on. I'm gonna fix it and I'm just gonna put it in a bun because I feel like that's better for this look now that it's coming more together, you see me? And then um, do the nails. I forgot to do the nails because that's the important part too. And then I'm gonna do photo shoot, that's it, yeah. So on to the nails. I already separated them, I put them in a bag. 
for which one blow my fingers. These nails are by Marseille Martin. Y'all, I had these nails since the day that, okay, so the day that she launched these things, had them on the site, I bought them and they're still good to this day. I've been using them, okay? So I have the, the richest cream one, rich as cream. They're the regular white, you know, white um, nails. But today I'm gonna actually do a, something a bit different for one of the fingers on each hand. So like I was saying this, I'm gonna be adding this on the nail. But also I have these nail stickers things like that I put them on yesterday and I don't want to take them off so we're just gonna put them on top of these so attempt one I'm gonna see if I put it on there the little sticky thing I put it on there and I'm gonna see if it sticks with the nail okay because I don't even know if I picked the right one on there we're gonna hope we're gonna hope it's right y'all can kind of see the little you know the red a little bit this is not the right nail size I put the wrong one on there oh shoot I did I put the wrong one on here but it's fine it'll be all right I'm gonna just keep going and have it but I was covering my hands but um this is what it looks like so far I really should have put the right side I like them so far and I'm going to add um this paper on top of the nail the false nail if that don't work okay so I Put it on there, it looks so wrong right now. But I'm gonna go ahead and grab my scissors and I'm gonna cut off the pieces that I don't need, you know? So, I tried it out and this is how it came out. You see how it's like cr crinkled and stuff like that? It's okay, but it's not where I wanted it to be. In all honesty, this isn't what I had in mind. It looks kind of raggedy, but it's okay because I want it like that rigid look. So I guess it'll be fine, I'll just be like, you know what I mean? Yeah, I also made something too, um, earrings. It's like, girl, what the wrong? Yep, they're earrings. I'm gonna put them on and y'all see. I just put the paper, that crinkled paper onto it. Actually, I'll put it this way. There we go. This is one. You see? Yeah. <laughs> so it's giving, it's like a crinkled vibe. Yeah, yeah. I kind of messed up on this side, but it's okay because my photo shoot, the way I'm gonna be, it's gonna be, I'm gonna be turned this way. So let me do the lip and then we're gonna take our pictures. Don't mind the inside of them anyway. Yeah, this is gonna be covered, like I said, turn this way. Anyway, cue the pictures. I got this thing right here from Five Below. I love this thing. It really helps. This really helps when it comes to the um, lighting. Oh my gosh, yes. This is the look I have so far. I'm loving it so far. Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna add the little hoodie thing that I made. <laughs> that I made for it. And I'm gonna see how that works. I'll take pictures with that. If it don't look right, I'll just do pictures like this. And I'm gonna take my hair out. Take my hair down at the bun with the ponytail. Let's get started. Y'all, here's a little hoodie thing that I made. It's just paper. <laughs> it's just paper, but I'm gonna just put it over my head and see how it works. That's the beauty of creativity, you know? realized I don't like the little thing that I had in mind. I'm doing my natural hair. So I got the pin right here and I'm going to take pictures like this. And we're gonna see how it goes. Y'all, I'm getting tired. I'm getting, go running back and forth to see if the pictures look good. The other ones do look good, but you guys will more than likely see these pictures with my natural hair, so yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna wrap it up here because I'm tired, I'm hungry, and I need to edit the pictures and edit the video. So without further ado, see you guys later. And um, hope you enjoy this video. And don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and give me, you guys, I want you guys to give me photo shoot idea, okay? I want some concepts, send me some concepts, okay? So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys later, bye.